It's the 2012 ACC football kickoff along with Riley Skinner. I'm Jeff Fischel and Georgia Tech coach Paul Johnson here. Coach, we just got the release of the media selections for the ACC this season. Coastal Division, Virginia Tech, Georgia Tech 1 and 2. Why are you guys playing perhaps the toughest game, the, the game that could decide the division week one? Well, that's, uh, that's an interesting question. Uh, <laughs> you didn't uh, schedule that? <laughs> no, we didn't, we didn't schedule it. But uh, it's been good for our guys. We've had a good off season, and, uh, it, you, you know, they had something to point to. And, you know, going to Blacksburg will be a huge challenge. And since I've been at Georgia Tech, that game has had major ramifications uh, on our division champions. So uh, I'm sure it will be important again this year. So it's a, a big game. And we, we talked to Tevin this, uh, earlier yesterday, and he seemed very confident in the offense and seems like he's a lot more comfortable um, in his role as a quarterback. It's got to help you've got four or five offensive line coming back in a triple option type offense. How big of a part are they to y'all's success? Well, they're huge. Hopefully we can keep them healthy. You know, that's where we struggled in the latter half of the season a year ago. But uh, we actually have more depth now than we've had since I've been in Tech. Uh, we finally got our scholarship numbers up on the offensive line and redshirted a couple of classes. So uh, there's a lot of depth there. Uh, we don't have a lot of older guys, only two seniors on scholarship in the offensive line, but a lot of guys who have played a lot of snaps. So I'm excited to see what they can do this year. Tevin said he'd really love to rush for 1,000 yards and throw for 1,000 yards. Do you think he's ready to have that kind of season? Yes, I, I mean, I think that, uh, you know, a better goal for Tevin would be rush for a thousand and throw for two, two. but uh, the, uh, certainly he's very capable of doing that. Well, and on the other side of the ball, let's go to the defensive side of the ball. Towards the end of the season, last year especially, in the last seven games, I think y'all gave up over 30 points a game. Right. Um, what can y'all do this year to make sure that y'all finish strong in November? Well, I think that, uh, you know, this is the third year of, of a new defensive system with uh, Coach Grow, and hopefully our guys will have grown some in that area. And, uh, you know, we've just got to, to stop giving up the, the huge plays. And, uh, you, you know, when you do that defensively and uh, you give it up in big chunks, uh, bad things happen. Right. And uh, so if we can limit that, uh, tackle better and find a way to be better on third down so we can get ourselves off the field. We've, we've struggled with on third down on defense. What do you feel like the biggest question mark for your team is going into the season? Uh, well, probably uh, offensively might be replacing uh, some skilled players who have played a lot uh, and, and defensively generating a pass rush. Uh, you know, we've got some young guys that, that haven't played a great deal that we think can be pretty good in that area, but until you actually do it on the field, uh, you, you never know. No Derek Morgans? So no Derek Morgans. Uh, we sure could use some. I got a heavy <laughs> dose of him as well. <laughs> yeah. so I don't wish that upon anybody. No, he can certainly rush the pass. <laughs> All right, week one, we're watching out for Georgia Tech taking on Virginia Tech. You're watching the ACC Digital Network.